Yeah. What you got, bro? I, I want to pick one, but I you got, you good, you good. All right, say what you got. This is for me, man. It's on me. Right. Read what you got. Say what you got. All right, boom. The shoes y'all got on, the clothes y'all got on. It's all, it's all group. It's, it's all spent by money. All spent by money. Yeah. Now, now we, all, we need money. Give now, me that. It is. Ecclesiastes it chapter. is. But it's, it's uh, the fact of the matter is, we all still trap, bro. Say it again. Honestly, we all still trap because we all had to spend fake currency to acquire what we need, like the purple gowns and all that. We all got to spend fake currency to acquire what we need. So seven twelve, we're all still trap right now. I mean, even if you know better. You can preach it, but how the fuck do we get out of it? Thank you. That's a good question. What's your name? I'm Mike. Mike. Mike got a good question. He said, we got to spend money for everything. You got to spend money by your shoes. You got to spend money by your clothes, right? And we still need money to live, right? I'm going to show you that the I'm Bible gonna, says what you just said. Hold on. I'm going to show you something. And I'll hold on. Let me show you. Right? Hold on. Let me show you. I'm going to show you the devil all over this money. We, right? We'll break that down for you in a minute. But let me show and you what you just said in the Bible. Right? Read what you got. And we got the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 7, verse 12. Come on. For wisdom is a defense. What does the Bible say? For wisdom is a defense. Come on. And money. And what? And money. And what? And Mike, you're not listening. You're not. What did he just say? Huh? What did I'm he just say? Him. He was giving me something, so he cut me off. All right. What you, you listening now? Yes. Sir. Read it again from the top. For wisdom is a defense. Wisdom is a defense, right? We need wisdom to navigate. You know that. You know yeah, that. I need you need wisdom. As you learn, you get experience. You know, oh, no, I'm not going to do that like that this time. I'm going to do it like that next time, right? Most of us get a lot of wisdom when? When we get locked up. That's when we meditate. We realize, oh, dang, I could have I, I never got caught if I did it this way. We meditate and we go wise and evil. God wants us to do that same thing in righteousness. Right. Right? Wisdom is a defense. Right? Wisdom, is, wisdom will defend you if you are here doing evil and you know how to do it. So that you don't get caught, right? right? Wisdom will defend you in righteousness as well. Right. If you keep God's commandments, it'll show you how to navigate to raise up strong sons right. to take over the world. Right. But we choose to use wisdom for what? Evil, right? right. All right, hold My on. Let me read I the know, last part I of the know verse. I'm being Mike, I know. Mike, let me read the last part of the verse because this is what you quoted. Come on. And money. And what? And money. You said money, right? No, no, no. I'm keeping it. That's mine. You said money, right? Yeah. You said we need money, right? Yeah. Right. Read it again. Money. And money. And money. Is a defense. Is what? Is a defense. So we need money too. We need money too. Why? Because it answers the things that we have need of. It is. Right? We don't need fake currency. We need money. It, it's, it's, it's just a tool. Just look at it as a tool. That's all it is. We, it, it could be a euro. Right? It could be a, a shekel. It don't matter what we call it. Because someone that rules this earth has deemed that it has value. Therefore, we need it to live, to eat, to survive, for water, for clothes, for shelter. We need it for those things, right? But we can't worship it. We can't worship, give me that no man can serve two masters. We can't worship money. But what I'm explaining, all right, what I'm saying is, all right, we look at the world and we can take care of it. How do we get away? Right, we can understand we being used, bamboozled, we're being, you know what I mean? Everything yeah. falls. What's the but solution? How do we get away from it? That's Mike, the solution. Right. How do we get away from it? How do we get away from what? From, from the lies. Right, how do we get how can we get back the to only the way, way to get away from the lies? How can we get back to the way we used to barter and, and trade and, and handle things back in the Understood, he wants how a solution. Can we get away from Mike wants a solution for the problems. Listen good, we're gonna read the solutions for you. Matthew 6 and 24, all right? We're gonna read it for you. All right, we're gonna read it for you. And what it's gonna show you I'm not being is that, because you know what our people do today? We're willing to break God's laws to make money. Am I right or am I wrong? That's what we're willing to do, right? We understand what's right and what's wrong, right? Money is, not, money is not evil. And to have a lot of it don't make you evil. You understand? But when you're willing to break God's laws to get money, now you evil. Read what you got. The book of Matthew, chapter 6, verse 24. Come on. No man can serve two masters. God said you can't serve two masters. You can only have one. Our master is supposed to be who? The Most High God. All right? The Most High God. It's supposed to be our master. The Most High God needs to be our master. All right? The Most High God is the author and the finisher of our faith. You understand? That's who he is. You can read about him in this book right here. If you really want to know, you'll open this book and you'll do what he says 
to. Right. Just like you would a father that you fear. That's the same way you would deal with the most high God, the right. author and the finisher of our faith. Right. You understand? And guess what? He gave you an example to follow. If you still don't understand, he gave us all an example to follow. You know who the example was? His son. Jesus the Christ, right? And we can read about the accounts of his life all throughout this Bible, right? Then we can read about the accounts of his life before he was put on this earth all throughout this Bible. It's right here for you to read. If you really want to know his name, you got to read the word of God. Read it again. No man can serve two masters. No man can serve two masters. The black man in the ghetto, his master is money. The black man in the ghetto, his master is the black woman. Bring it out. The, his master is the black woman. I'm talking about the black man in the ghetto. You know why? Because the decision he makes, you know why he bought a car? You know why he bought a clothes? You know why he sell drugs? Why he out in the corner risking his life to sell drugs? So that he can impress the black woman. That's why he do it. So he can get the draws from the black woman. That's why he do it. Am I right or am I wrong? Huh? Am I right or am I wrong? My brothers go out and hustle so that they can go and get whatever woman they want to have for the night. That's why they hustle. That's, that's most of the case. Tell me a different scenario. I used to hustle, but I bought a business. Tell me a different scenario of why you don't want money to get a woman. Because most of the hustlers ain't married. Right. No Most of the hustlers ain't married. Figure you understand? Out. Most of the hustlers got baby mamas. I'm, they not, I'm not saying they don't have children. Woman, hustlers got children, and they take care of them. Listen, you understand? I don't want a woman that's attracted to money. I want a woman that's attracted to me, love that I can give her, and things that I can do for her without the money. All right, you say you want a woman that's attracted to you, right? But remember, no man can serve two masters, right? Remember where we were. Read it again. No man can serve two masters. For either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will hold to the one and despise the other. So if you love, if you love money, guess what? You gonna hate God because God say that you can't work on the Sabbath day. You're like, nah, I can't do that. I gotta get my money on the Sabbath. Today the Sabbath day, brother. You ain't supposed to be buying, selling nothing. Right. It's the Sabbath day. You ain't supposed to be buying, selling nothing. You understand? Nothing. It's the, it's, the, it's the Sabbath day. You ain't supposed to be buying, selling nothing. So you can't love money and love God all together. You gotta love God first. He gonna bless you with everything else. But you need That's the know. way that this works. But you Nation is men leading by example. Nation is community. Nation is children with role models. 